Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Just a quick video to let you know that Microsoft has recently started to block the Windows 11 upgrade and updates on Windows 10 devices for users who are still using Internet Explorer 11 as their primary or default browser, even if those Windows 10 devices meet the minimum system and hardware requirements to be upgraded to Windows 11. Now, in a recent statement, Microsoft has basically said that Windows 10 devices with Internet Explorer 11 set as the primary or default browser won't be receiving and getting the upgrade offer uh, to be updated through Windows Update uh, to Windows 11 anymore. And that upgrade block Microsoft started to implement on the 31st of March this year, 2022. Now today we are already on the 3rd of April in my region of the world. So that means more or less three days ago, Microsoft implemented that upgrade block if you are still using Internet Explorer 11 as your default browser on Windows 10 and are wanting to upgrade. Now, their reason for saying this, Microsoft says that for some users, after upgrading to Windows 11, their saved information and data from Internet Explorer 11 um, might not be accessible if they have not accepted to import their information and data into the Microsoft Edge web browser before the upgrade. And uh, because of this, um, to safeguard um, uh, the upgrade experience, Microsoft says that they have applied a compatibility hold on devices affected by this issue, which means that for some Windows 10 users uh, that want to upgrade but haven't um, uh, imported their information and data into Microsoft Edge yet, um, they will not be offered uh, the update until they do so. And obviously, if you have imported your Internet Explorer 11 information and data into the Microsoft Edge web browser in Windows 10 before upgrading to Windows 11, um, then Microsoft says your device should not be affected by this issue. So it's very simple. If you, for whatever reason, still want your Internet Explorer information and you want to upgrade to Windows 11 and you are, uh, you, you are, are affected by this issue, then you just need to import the Internet Explorer 11 uh, data and information on your Windows 10 device into the Microsoft Edge web browser. And how to do this, it's very simple. You just head to your profile picture, click on Manage Profile Settings, and in the Your Profile page, you just click on Import Your Data, and yeah, you can import your browser data from other browsers like your favorites, passwords, history, and other browser data from another browser. Now, unfortunately, I can't demonstrate because I've long since uninstalled Internet Explorer 11 from my Windows 10 device. So if you do find yourself in this uh, this uh, situation and haven't um, imported your data yet and are wanting to upgrade, then either import your data or Microsoft does say though that a future release of Edge will address this problem. So um, I will keep you posted on that when that update um, does roll out, which even if you haven't imported your data, Microsoft says they will roll out a update in the future to address the issue where you will then uh, be able to upgrade to Windows 11. And um, if you're not willing to wait and you do find yourself in this predicament, then just import your data uh, into Edge. And if you do meet the system requirements, then that upgrade block will be lifted and you'll be able to update to Windows 11 if you choose to do so. So thanks for watching. And I will see you in the next one.